Welcome guys, in this video we are going to talk about jQuery hierarchy selectors. If you have seen the previous video, we have shown you how you can use the jQuery basic selectors. Now in this video, we're just going to focus on the hierarchy selectors. Okay, let's get started then. So, as you can see at the bottom part of the page, we have a child selector. Uh, descendant, adjacent, and sibling selector. We're gonna tackle it one by one. So let's start with the child selector first. So a child selector selects all the children of the specified element or the parent. So uh, in this page, I believe this um, this paragraph have a div parent which is in this case as you can see on the screen it's no attribute so let's try that uh no attribute let me mm, let me copy that let's say no attribute let me select that first so you can show the highlighted div there you go then i want to check all or highlight all of its uh, children element so we can do that by uh, passing the greater than sign and all elements which is the asterisk select so as you can see we have selected every um, what they call this element inside of it okay let me click that again to remove the highlight and what if I only want the direct anchor so no attribute and then i just want to have the direct anchor so greater than sign than a so there you go then last that's one more example i think uh, a good example is uh paragraph so we'll be expecting a paragraph here there this paragraph isn't selected because let's try to see because it's not a direct child of the no attribute because this p is an is an ancestor of the div id no attribute okay mm, let's move on with the descendant selectors so descendant selector selects all the descendants uh like the grandchildren um but it doesn't called as grandchildren it's called as a descendant so let's say for example i want to select this this and this so as you can see on the elements tab uh this anchor is descendant of the new attribute but it is the child of the paragraph which is the paragraph is the direct direct child of the div new attribute let's try to select that and its other descendants so we can do that by no view and then space and then anchor there you go so uh this one are the descendants so the difference here is if we if we only want to get the direct child let me refresh that we'll only be expecting one probably this one yes because it's the digital direct what if if we want to get all the descendants including the direct so we need to say no attribute and then space then a there you go so hopefully you have seen the difference and then moving on let me refresh again what if i want to get the adjacent selector uh, meaning the uh, selecting an element next to next to um to your selected element let's say in this example we have the div container right so the next element is the script tag so let me try that on the console so container and then uh, let's try to see 
Let's make this. So as you can see, we have the script there, right? But we won't be, um, we cannot highlight the script within the page, right? So let's try to choose another one. Uh, maybe this, uh, let's look inside. Maybe the moderate blue would be a good example. So let me refresh the page. So no attribute. I want the next div. It will be it will give me one element, of course. There you go. So what if I want to get all of the next siblings or next div, right? So I just need to change the plus sign the D tilde. Mm, again, let me refresh. No attributes, and then tilde. Tilda and then you select select that what happened again no uh, yeah no s sorry about that select there you go so after the no attribute the siblings are the moderate blue the next one also is all a moderate blue and then the next one is box one and then we didn't select the p because we only specified the div so the next div which is the menu this one is being highlighted okay last but not the least let me try that again let's say again no attribute and then i want to get the next siblings which is the paragraph in this case you only have one so we have expected one result as highlighted so there you go guys hopefully you have enjoyed and completely watched the video see you all on my next video cheers bye bye